Are you also a fan of drinking three-in-one coffee? We have original, brown coffee, or black coffee, or white coffee, or whatever that you have there. Did you know that one pack of this one contains more sugar than one glass of soft drinks? Yes, one glass of regular soft drinks has less sugar than this one. I'm not saying that you will drink regular soft drinks, regular soda, but the next time you take this three-in-one coffees, try to remember that each pack actually contains a net carbohydrates of more than 20 grams. More than 20 grams in this black coffee, more than 20 grams in this brown coffee, and more than 20 grams of net carbohydrates or sugar in this original coffee. So net carbohydrates, it's not just about the sugar that you can see here on the label, but it is the carbohydrates minus the fiber, and that is your net carbohydrates. Net carbohydrates is not just about the sugar, but it's also about the other carbohydrates like fructose or lactose or starch that is already inside, but it is still convertible into energy. It is still convertible into glucose that can still increase your blood sugar and eventually increase your insulin and that can be a problem when regularly stimulated because insulin resistance, the chronic stimulation of insulin, is the root cause of many diseases like inflammation and metabolic syndrome. And metabolic syndrome and inflammation is also linked in many other illness like tumor formation and also having a lot of other problems like cancers, fatty liver, heart attack, dementia, and many other diseases that is happening in many of our organ systems. So the next time you take three-in-one coffee, try to remember that each one contains about five teaspoons equivalent of white sugar when it comes to net carbohydrates, when it comes to net impact in our blood sugar and our overall insulin level. So I'm Dr. Josephine Grace Roja, and remember to always stay low carb so that we all stay safe. Thank you.